hello community i hope you are doing good in this discussion we will see how to use underscore name underscore search method and what is the purpose and in case you missed previous discussion about how to use default underscore get method and in case you want to learn more about odoo you can visit the weblens channel under this home screen you can see odoo 17 and 18 development tutorial right now we are working on this playlist in case you are beginner and want to learn from the scratch you can use this playlist because this is the main playlist and those are the sub playlist okay let's back to our main topic and before that guys if you didn't subscribe this channel please subscribe it will help me a lot and you will also get a latest notification for the upcoming videos right so let's say what is the main purpose of the name underscore search method so let me give you one useful topic which is student let's say i'm going to school if I'm going to this generic settings invoice you can see here we have a name field and we have a different field which is the code right now if you want to search in a many to one field okay here this is the school model inside the school model i have added a new field which is many to one field for the student profile and here i would like to search students based on the name or based on the gender you can see here the gender right gender male female or one so whatsoever is matched from here this field or the name field right this name field if it is matched in between these two and I, I would like to show those records like as of now you can see I'm using here only name but let's say if I will try to search with the female or let's say male I'm not getting any output right but I would like to add the same feature which is available in the currency so you can see here uh, I would like to use I, I'm trying to search here the AD I'm getting the result as a AD right if I will use here United Arab so still I'm getting here AD right because I'm using here and now I'm searching the name field but let's say I'm, I'm trying to search here stat and getting USD but let's say if I'm using rupees I'm getting INR if I'm searching with the name right so still I'm getting here the currency if I will search with the currency code, I am getting still that record. So I would like to also use the same way, right? Using the underscore name underscore search method. Now the question is where we have to override that method inside the school or inside the student model. So this is the simple answer. So if you override for the specific model, right, then you have to override that method inside this table. Uh, model not in the parent model so for that we can go to here student right so this is the school model you can see we don't need to use this one but we can use directly the student here we can use here name search like this and yes we have to also use one more operator which is api dot model okay here you can see self as a model instance then after the name whatsoever we are searching here right so this one automatically we will get here in this name parameter after the domain so domain if you guys know uh, let's say this one while we are searching the result like this so this is the domain by default it's none operator is the i like operator by default if you see here limit is eight record you can see so by default it's a eight limit and order by by default whatsoever we set it's the order by it's taking that order by and by default it's a none here okay here we, here very interesting part is if you want to override like whatsoever the condition based on the condition you don't need to call the super method okay 
you can directly call underscore search method here we can use domain then after the limit and order order like this might be you confused right why we are using this underscore search method not the name underscore search the reason is uh, we are using here name field this rack underscore name the model attribute right the metadata whatsoever the fields you mention here it's searching automatically those one by default it's a name field okay so here it's uh, hard to maintain your conditions the custom conditions so that's the reason we need to avoid call uh, super call so we have to use here self dot underscore search okay with this parameter so let me add here like this and you can see here the return statement is not written tuple or record set it's written the query object and by and guys if you don't know how to start or restart service or how to configure or do in pycharm please check editor level playlist i already explained everything okay so let's say if i will try to use the the, the like this you can see name search right you can see the first time and the second time i have added three times dd right and now here you can see it's called the query but without the where condition so here it's our mistake you can see here the domain right it's a blank so due to that we it's not added here the where condition then after the operator is i like the limit is id uh, sorry eight and order by is the id so let's add here the domain operator name operator name right like this now we must have to use or condition right because either we are searching from the name or either we are searching from the gender field if you don't know this domain i already explained in detail you can see here this one so if possible you can also watch this session okay so here you can see fee may All right, so we didn't restart the service. Don't worry. Okay, now you can see. Three records, right? Let's compare here. You can see three records. Harry Potter, Fema and there is a blank so that means unnamed right then after if you will search one so you will get a lot of students also let's say if i'm searching the web right or let's say like this so i'm also get i'm searching from the name field plus i'm also searching from this gender field so let's say this none right let me open add here the mail and now you can see the mail now might be you confused right i, I used here male so female and male both having this name right male so due to that you can see the four records okay so this is the main purpose of this underscore name underscore search method if you have any doubt related this method please comment below and see you in our next session